what are the salient features? Because BJP already had the first mover advantage. They have announced maximum number of candidates in both these states. How's the battlefield in both these states looking now? Uh, so a really interesting list uh, from the B, uh, from the Congress here in Madhya Pradesh, Ankit, and it will be uh, you know uh, Congress is also uh, pushing a soft Hindutva agenda, and uh, it's against uh, you know the uh, tried and tested agenda of uh, the BJP here. So. Uh, Vikram Masthal, a small screen actor playing as Hanuman in Ramayan serial, again Shivraj Singh Chauhan uh, from Budni constituency. And apart from that, I would also like to tell you that uh, they have dropped the former speaker of Madhya Pradesh NP Prajapati from Gotegaon constituency and uh, three other MLAs also. But I wanted to focus on one thing because the Congress is time again repeating what Kashiram used to say, Jiski Jitri Sankhya Bhari, Uski Utni Hisse Dari. So in their first list, uh, out of 140 44 candidates, 47 or 33 percent are from the general category, uh, 39 or 27 percent are from the OBC category, 30 tribals, 21 percent, and 22, uh, tw uh, 22 candidates, which, which comes around 15 percent, are from scheduled type, uh, uh, scheduled caste category, and six are from minority uh, category, including one Muslim candidate. So, uh, these are the salient features of uh, the Congress list here in Madhya Pradesh. And uh, uh, they have given tickets to, you know, dynasts of Congress and, uh, you know, the dynastic families of the BJP also who has joined uh, the Congress recently. Hmm. Very, very interesting. I'm not, uh, all, uh, talking about Chhattisgarh, uh, where Bhupesh Bhagel is hoping that he would be able to make a comeback. And Chhattisgarh has had a history of repeating governments. Uh, about 30 names have been announced. At least the confusion over T.S. Singh Deo for the Congress party side is over. BJP has not announced the name from the Ambikapur uh, candidate, but Congress has made sure that the Deputy Chief Minister is in the fray. Yes, though they have dropped five sitting MLAs uh, in this first list only. Uh, but as you said, uh, the suspense at least from Congress side is up and uh, T.S. Singh Dev has been shielded from uh, uh, Ambikapur. And let's uh, wait and watch what BJP will do because as of now, they have not, not named any candidates from Ambikapur. Very, very interesting. Uh, thank you so much, Anurag, for joining us.